Yeah, yeah. Get on this too. Do it all together. Yeah, come on, all three of us. I'll carry this interview. <laughs> okay. Not only am I excited by being a geek, but when, when, and I'm not just saying this, I'm really not. Okay. You can agree with me. When a company like Gibson gets behind something like this, yeah. no, I'm serious. I, Come on, let's I, talk I, about yeah, this. Yeah. Like, not that Twitch needs legitimacy because it's massive already, but this is such a good decision. This is a huge audience. You guys own all these companies now, yeah. right? It's not yeah. just about the guitars and the music. And it's just so cool to be a part of something that is, except you know, you don't have to hide being a geek. I'm, I'm a gamer. I've been that way for a while. What games do you play? Are you, you a gamer? Do you love now games? Now we're in, now we're in sync here. You know what? I'm not a big gamer, but I think I understand what you're saying because uh, it's about passion. Being a geek is about being passionate or something. I know guys that that play these. I have a young son that's 11 that plays a guitar, and I mean that's all he wants to do. He's got an amazing passion for that, and in its own way, that's geeky. Absolutely. Well, my passion happened to be on a mat and figuring out how to twist guys up, but uh, right, right, right. it's still, still passion and it's still geeky in its own way. Now that's a cool passion. Your passion is an incredibly cool passion. Wow, I mean, seriously, right? Yes. I mean, but this is something that when I heard about Twitch, I was like, people are actually watching people play games. Oh, yeah. And so, yeah, can I give a plug to my channel, Social Tron Live, this is my <laughs> channel. We're doing charity work and having a lot of fun with celebrities. Will you please come on my show? I'd love to. You heard that here. Uh, I have a show called Grunberg Live, it's like a talk show. And, but we also just did a 36-hour game-a-thon for epilepsy, and we're doing other charities too. Did a Zelda thing for Robin Williams. We're using the power and the audience of Twitch to do good. And You've it's, done the ALS Ice Bucket Challenge. I just did it today. Awesome. I did it today. J.J. Abrams nominated me today, and I did it today. And it was cold, but I'm in the Woodland Hills, so it was good. I barely I felt it. Help from the shrinkage from the ice. <laughs> yeah. so. What movie are you in? I'm in a lot of movies, but I'm here for King of the Nerds mostly. We just finished season three oh, awesome. uh, on TBS, and this year is going to be epic. King of the Nerds? Why have I not heard of this? No, and I'm, I apologize. It's not, have you heard of it? Yeah, I've heard it. You lying son of a bitch. Really? I didn't know that. Wait a minute, that's awesome. Yeah. I got to check it out. I'm going to be crowned King of the Nerds. All these categories that are nerd related. Oh, I've and heard of it. Only I've heard of it. I'm sorry. I just the it's name didn't register. You sound like my mom right now. No, 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 no. I, I okay. I get it. Nothing I do is cool. Right. Well, you, will you come on my show too? Uh, sure. Okay. And will you come on my show? Absolutely. All right. Cool. You heard it here. Well, uh, well I just I just did D and D. I mean, if you know D and D, if you know Dungeons and Dragons, it's their 40th anniversary. That's what I'm giving away. I'm presenting here tonight the uh, tabletop award for tabletop game. And uh, that's kind of a real geeky thing. And it's become, obviously, 40 years. It's a huge thing. Did you play D&D? &D? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I did too. And, I, and Audible has a book this year. And I read a chapter in that book. That's a pretty geeky moment for me. That's kind of a geek, legitimate moment. And also being on Heroes, that was, like, that put me in the geek stratosphere. What about you guys? A geeky moment. Uh, I, I'm not saying I have an... Hold on. It's just like the movie business, rolling. All right, um, I have it almost complete my Little Pony collection from the 80s. I still have all my Magic the Gathering cards. I'm, I grew up playing I'm video the guy games. That dumped that bin out accidentally onto the ground. <laughs> picking, up the yard sale. Uh, picking up my Little Ponies and stacking <laughs> yeah. them back there neatly, exactly. hoping she won't notice. But <laughs> right, right, right. Dumped right. all my unicorns out onto the street. Oh, <laughs> oh, that's that's terrible. You should be ashamed of yourself. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, hey, it's Greg Grunberg, and you've just been buzzed. I'm Randy Couture, and you've just been buzzed. I'm Mindy Robinson, and you've just been buzzed. Hold up your old map, Verizon. T-Mobile's network now reaches 96% of Americans.